this problem is very similar to the previous example where I was um, writing the equation of the line. This is an application problem. So it says, suppose that a household's monthly water bill in dollars is a linear function of the amount of water a household uses in hundreds of cubic feet, HCF. When graphed, the function gives the line with slope of 1.75. If the monthly cost for 18 HCF is $47.64, what is the monthly cost for 14 HCF? So they've given me, remember, these are like my X values and these are like my Y values. So my X values are in HCFs and my Y values are in money, okay? So if I'm gonna use this information they gave me, it's going to be 18, the HCFs first, and then the money, the 47.64. So this is my X1 and this is my Y1. That is all I need to find the equation of the line. So if I write the equation of the line using my formula, this is the formula I'm using. All I need to do is distribute the slope and then combine the like terms. Let me see what 1.75 times 18 is. It's 31.5. And then let me combine these likes, like terms. So negative 31.5 plus 47.64. I get positive 16.24. Now this is the equation of the line. This is going to help me predict any other number along that line. So it says, what is the cost of 14 HCF? Well remember, HCF is the X value. So if they're asking me for 14 HCFs, then that means I'm going to be plugging in 14 for my X value. and we get the y value of 40.74. But remember, the y value represents money. So this is how much it would cost for 14 HCF. So you need to get the information, use this formula to get the equation of the line. Once you have the equation of the line, you can use that to predict for anything else, okay?